Today I'm going to show you how to catch a basketball pass like a boss. I'm Coach Charlie with Attack Basketball Academy. As a premier basketball player development coach, I have trained thousands of youth players all over the world on the techniques and tactics needed to be elite catchers that all their teammates want to pass to. So in this video today, I'm going to show you the secret trick to catching a pass that all the pros know. Next, I'm going to show you how to catch a basketball pass with your eyes. Last, I'm going to show you how to catch a basketball pass like if you have three hands. And on top of that, I have a bonus that I'll give to you, but only if you stick around to the very end. Let's get right into the secret trick to catching a pass that all the pros know. See, that secret trick that all the pros know about catching passes is that you must meet the pass. You don't ever want to wait for a pass because that gives a defender too much room to contest the pass, but knock it out and then go for probably easy dunk, right? So when the ball is coming to you, you want to meet the basketball, right? So the last, what we teach at Attack Basketball, the last three feet of a pass is yours, no excuse. The ball's in your area, go get it, right? Go secure it with two hands, right? Go get that basketball. Ball's bounce right here, go get the basketball. Don't wait till it come to you. Too late, everybody wants the ball. So when you see that basketball in your area, go get it. So here's a simple bounce up drill, right? Go meet the pass drill, right? Instead of being reluctant, waiting on the ball, no, go get the basketball, right? Go get it, three, go get it, two, Last one, go meet it, secure it. Bring that ball close to your body. We're trying to reach 1,000 subscribers by the end of the month, and we need your help. We roll out five new videos every week to help you become a premium basketball player. So help us reach our goal and click that subscribe button. Now, let me explain what I mean by catching the basketball with your eyes. Not only do you catch with your hands, obviously, physically, we have to do that, but first you catch with your eyes because you have to see the ball coming to you. So once you see that ball coming to you, then you go meet that basketball. But catch with your eyes, because you always have defenders lurking. So I'm looking this ball all the way in until I go grab this basketball. So now, not only am I going to meet the basketball the last three feet, I'm looking this ball all the way through. And I'm securing this basketball, right? I'm securing this basketball, that's the key. Right, you can also look at it, make a dribble move, bouncing it, and go and secure it, coming into a triple threat move. You're around the basket, put up a shot. Mix up your skills on this stuff, right? Meet it, go catch it, secure it, shot fake, lift up, shot, right? Miss it, oh, miss it, put your ball back in the hole, right? Last three feet, go meet it, lift up, shoot the basketball. Having some fun with the game and having some fun with the drill. Before you catch it with your hands, catch it with your eyes, look, locate the basketball, go get a feel for it and go grab it. Now I'm gonna show you how to catch a basketball pass like you have three hands. Okay, now, what do I mean by having three hands? I got two, where's the third hand? Your chest. See, when you're holding off a defender with your inside hip and shoulder, imagine me holding somebody off of my left hip, my left shoulder. I'm holding them off and I'm giving my target outside of that defender. See, not only do I have to go meet the pass, go catch the basketball with my eyes, sometimes I may have to use my chest as a third hand, as a helper to grab that basketball because my other hand, my off hand we call it, is occupied. Occupied in a good way because I'm holding my defender off the right that I have. I have the right to keep the spacing. Now I can't dislodge them, but I have the right to hold them off. So learning how to hold somebody off, so what I want you simply doing is spinning the ball out, grabbing the ball, right, with one hand, bringing the ball to your chest. Turning strongly, lift up and shoot the basketball. Hold them off, go meet it, grab it, look the pivot turn, lift up shot. Okay, last one. Right, mix it up. Go grab it, change my pivots, lift up shot. Learn to be tough with the basketball, we call it ball toughness. But that's how you use your chest as a third hand. And when you put all this together, it makes you an elite level catcher because now all your, all your teammates, no matter if you have a little space well, a lot of space, they go on to pass you the ball because they know when you get the ball, you can make impact plays. Let's keep the momentum going with that bonus I mentioned earlier. We've covered a lot in this video, and I really want to make sure I'm helping you out. So I'd like to offer you a guide that covers all the muscle and basketball principles and in what stretch to apply them. This is a powerful guide of best practice tips and skills empowering you to take charge of your game. Just click the link in the description below. You can download the guide I put together as my gift to you. Enjoy it and keep attacking.